Hey, don't forget it's Mother's Day this weekend. Oh. Uh, are you looking at, <laughs> maybe you, this will help. Look at that yes. maybe modernize your mom this Mother's Day. Well, perfume expert Katie Puckrick from YouTube's popular fragrance channel. It's called Katie Puckrick Smells. She's here with tips. And by on the way, she to smells treat. great. And you would know because you smell everybody. Uh, treat mom <laughs> to the perfect perfume. Katie, good morning. Good morning. Perfect gift for mamas, right? Yeah. Perfume. Yeah, I mean, perfume is a great gift because it's intimate. It's it's like a little vacation in a bottle. Not the kind of vacation in a bottle you like to take. <laughs> hey, Katie. Involving alcohol. <laughs> I've seen you at the office parties. Isn't there alcohol in these things? Yeah. yeah. There <laughs> but, but I have a question, though, because choosing perfume, sometimes it can be difficult. For mom, it doesn't matter who it is because everybody has their own s Sniff, scent, scent? Well, everybody has their own association. I think we can all agree that an onion smells like an onion. We all yes. are agree that an apple smells the way it smells. But, you know, people often gravitate towards certain fragrances mm -hmm. because it reminds them of certain happy times in their lives. And they can kind of get stuck in a rut. I mean, mom can get stuck in a rut with the signature yeah, like scent. It, it's like the moms. Have you smelled yeah. some of the moms? Like, with all due respect, love moms. But the ones that have the perfume, the, perfume. the perfume yeah. from 1960-something. Well, 1960 the, I'm just saying. The, the, issue, the issue here is that the more you wear one fragrance, if you just stick to one fragrance uh -huh. day in and day out, you lose your sense of smell. You you, lo you can't smell it anymore, oh, and you wow. can't enjoy really? it anymore. Really? I didn't so, know it's funny you mentioned yeah. the rut because I that I went through this with my mom last whatever the last holiday. We have to buy stuff for people, uh -huh. <laughs> and and she liked that Paris, right? You know? And they don't make that anymore. Oh, they so do. So they have a, Yves Saint Laurent Paris. Yeah, but they switched to something different. There's a easy and something. Yeah, they always do those little flangers. Right. Little side so notes. now that so I got her the new one and she didn't like it because no. it was just tweaked enough where yeah. it wasn't the same for her. It's not the same. But the thing is, is that you know it is good to switch things up because you you kind of get stuck rigidly well, in time. I don't You're know like, about that because the only time I wear the Mademoiselle Chanel is the only time this one starts to sniff me. Other than that, yeah, there's won't, something about won't, that he one. He won't pay it attention. Just... Maybe one of these wore. Can I change up the perfume too? Let's let's see what's I good for moms. What do you have? Well, the, one of the one of the tactful ways to kind of steer mom yeah. away from eau de mal hair, you okay. know, if she's sort of stuck in that that 80s uh -huh. uh, perfume, is to say, look, mom. I love smelling it on you. Uh -huh. You smell fantastic, but um, I don't think it fits you anymore. It's not living up to your sparkle and pizzazz. Okay. So, so what you can do is uh -huh. you can kind of stay in the same area. If your mom likes florals mm -hmm. or if she likes citruses, uh -huh. you just look for something that's in the same area. Which so, is... so if she likes uh, citrus and she yeah. likes light florals and uh -huh. she's kind of a classy lady, you can go with the updated Chanel Number no. Five, which Ooh. is called O. Premier. See now, look at that face. Katie shows off. No, with the... the other end, the other oh. end. So, <laughs> no, Ooh, I don't me. like oh, it. No, let me smell this. So thing. this is this is like a, kind of a powdery, sophisticated jeans with heels fragrance. I want to get through all three of them so before this, our segment's like, over. And this so. this one here is Jo Malone, okay. and this is called Jamal. Orange Blossom. And this one is like a happy, sunshiny smell, very orangey, mm. very like clay. a fruit. All right. Okay. Th this one here by Estee Lauder is called Sensuous. Flowery. This and this one. is more oh. if you don't if you don't like florals. This is probably for you. It's if you're not so crazy about florals. No, no I, I like fruit. I like fruit. So this is sandalwood, and this is an ambery fragrance. This one. Here we go to a very sexy. This is Stella hey by Stella McCartney. Now, how did she know Can you were I, gonna? May I? Go, go ahead. This one I call clean and dirty at the same time. No. Might be a fit for you. Oh. Okay. <laughs> and it's roses, huh? it's musk, and hey yeah. That wasn't it's, on TV. It, <laughs> I didn't realize that was, that was inappropriate <laughs> what I did. Do you like this? <laughs> I like how naturally Katie, that comes Katie to you. Katie saw that. I went like this. <laughs> and I'm like, whoa, sorry. <laughs> And it works, oh. baby. You know it what? Works. This one does smell well, really good. Yeah. So th this one is like mystery, a little mm. deep, subtle, yeah. and a um, little naughty. Katie, you uh, a have a naughty. whole uh, YouTube channel devoted to yes. this. So you should check her out. Katie Pogrick uh, smells up on the YouTube channel. We put a link on our website, foxfivesandiego.com. <laughs> Click see it on Fox get, 5. I can't get this one from my mom, though. No, well, you don't want to be you know, if she's oh, a little on. saucier, spicier. I, Take it easy, Kate. I, I, I want, <laughs> don't let that image live and in your head too long. Erica, but. I'm coming in. You can come sniff in a little <laughs> bit. I'm coming. It smells good. It smells good. Mm. Yeah.